Good morning, guys. Welcome to day 61. Uh, just standing outside the guest house we stayed in last night. Uh, we're getting back on the road and heading for Hoi An. Hoping to get to Hoi An uh, this evening. It's 180k. It's 8.30 in the morning, so we've got, uh, what, 10, 11 hours to try and do 180k. Um, fingers crossed we can get there and uh, there are no problems with the bike. Uh, fingers crossed. And uh, hopefully, obviously I'll film the journey, film some of the stuff we stop off to see. Uh, the scenery suddenly got really good around here. Uh, this is the town we stayed in last night. Uh, I call it a town with the loosest of meanings because there is literally nothing here. Um, we had to live off of crisps and biscuits last night because there was nowhere to get any food. So we're gonna stop somewhere on the way, get some food, and then we are on the road and uh, on our way. So uh, uh, stay tuned guys, and this is the journey from wherever the hell we are right now to Hoi An. Guys, so two minutes after filming that intro, Betty wouldn't start, uh, brought her down to the nearest mechanic, and uh, I think he's fixed it, but he literally tinkered with it for two minutes and charged me 100,000 dong, which in the scheme of things is a fucking rip off. Uh, this town is the first town we've been to where everyone is a dick. Everywhere in Vietnam, everyone's been so friendly, so nice, fixed our bikes for super cheap, never ripped us off. We get to this town and everyone is a dick. This mechanic behind me is a fucking ripoff. It's really pissed me off. Um, we're getting back on the road. Hopefully Betty works. She seems to work okay at the moment, but he literally did fuck all and then charged me loads of money. So I am pretty fuming at this town. Um, I'm not even sure what it's called. Dak Glee, I think. If you're ever driving through Vietnam and you get to Dak Glee, get the hell out of here as quickly as possible because everyone is a dick. So my bike was limping pretty badly and I saw a garage just in the middle of the mountain so I stopped and it's 9.30 in the morning and these guys behind me are having an absolute rave so they invite me in for a beer and uh, I'm going to try and get my bike fixed because it is limping um, but whilst I'm waiting I might as well have a beer at 9.30 in the morning with these guys um, and they're having a good old party taking loads of photos of us and stuff. Hi. I was just taking a pit stop. Um, I'm scared to turn Betty off because she is having a bit of a mare. Um, I think there's something wrong with the fuel pump because whenever I turn her off, she takes quite a while to start. Uh, we are literally in the middle of nowhere. 
Um, the route from Dak Wok, where we were last night, to Hoi An uh, is just mountainous and there's nothing in between it. Uh, what you do get though is some pretty epic scenes and this river we're going to be following for about the next 40, 50k uh, and it flows all the way to the sea and to Hoi An. Uh, so stay tuned, um, we should make it. I, uh, fingers crossed because Betty is limping. Uh, poor old Betty Swanson. I don't know what's wrong with her but she's just a piece of shit. I love her dearly but she's causing me no end of issues and um, if I break down here it's a real survival situation so shit's got serious. It's got real and Fingers crossed this video makes the light of day because if it doesn't, it means that um, I'm lost somewhere in the wilderness. But hopefully, we uh, we make it. we made it to Hoi An, thank fuck. Uh, we found ourselves a really nice guest house for pretty cheap. Uh, I'm not gonna show you that side of the room because Max is in his pants, uh, but this side of the room, nice flat screen TV, massive bed, and even better than that, we've got a bathtub, an actual bathtub. So I'm gonna be having me a bath because We've been on the road for four days now and I feel disgusting. Uh, but we made it, we're in Hoi An. Betty just about survived. She's limping like f a little bitch, but she'll be all right eventually. Uh, but that's it for today. Uh, remember to keep watching the videos, give it a thumbs up if you like it and keep following the adventure. So peace out guys.